Hello friends, welcome to the Ekaranalu. In this video, we discuss the topic how to frame questions in the present perfect tense and the present perfect continuous tense. The sentence structure in the present perfect tense is subject plus have or has plus V3. To make it a yes no question, just invert the subject and the auxiliary verb then it becomes a yes no question it's very easy isn't it just invert the subject and the auxiliary verb please do remember this point now let's try some examples here is a sentence he has painted the picture here subject is he Auxiliary verb has main verb painted object the picture. Now let's make it a question. First comes the auxiliary verb has, then subject he, then the remaining part painted the picture. This is a yes no question. Now some more examples. She has written a story. It's a sentence. Has she written a story? It is a yes no question. Based upon this structure, we can make double H questions very easily. Now, some double H questions. Why has she written a story? Why hasn't she written a poem? Why has she not written a book? When has she written a story? Like this, we can make a number of questions. Now, the questions in the present perfect continuous tense. In this tense, the sentence structure is subject plus, have or has plus, been plus, v1 plus, ing. The question structure is have or has plus subject plus, been plus, v1 plus, ing now let's take some examples you have been learning english have you been learning english why have you been learning english why haven't you been learning latin which language have you been learning for the past 10 years what have you not been learning like this we can continue making questions friends you know, learning is infinite. Here comes up a small recap with I, we, you and they. We use have and with he, she, it, we use has in the present tense. Thank you for watching this video. Bye bye.